Hello, it's Dr. Triple Seven. In today's video, I'll be showing you guys how to install custom themes and icon packs on Ubuntu. So for those of you who have been around my YouTube channel or have been subscribed for like a super long time, you would know that I actually just posted Ubuntu videos a long time ago. Like when I first started the channel, I did post a couple of Ubuntu videos. Now, um, for a long, long time, I actually have not touched Ubuntu um, on the channel, just posting strictly Windows videos. Um, but I thought I'd try it again. So I posted on Twitter and Facebook the other day to see if you guys would be interested in me posting any Ubuntu videos. And I got some pretty positive feedback, both on Facebook and Twitter. So I decided I'd go through and post one tutorial and see how you guys like it. So please leave it in the comment section below or contact me via Twitter or Facebook or Google Plus, whatever. And let me know if you guys like uh, this kind of video, if you like Ubuntu tutorials. And if you do, I will continue to make some. If you guys don't like them, then I will stop immediately. Do keep in mind though, even if I do start posting Ubuntu videos, they will not replace Windows or replace anything else. They'll just kind of be an add-on and a little more variety to the channel. Um, like I said, so they won't replace anything. It'll just be an extra uh, stream of content. Besides that, guys, uh, like I said, leave your opinion on that below or via Twitter, Facebook, etc. Back to today's video, though, I'll be showing you guys how to install custom themes and icon packs on Ubuntu. Now, one of my favorite things about Ubuntu is being able to customize it up the wazoo, make it however you like it. And so, as you can tell right now, I have my system set up to a style that I like. I'm a person who likes, you know, dark themes. So, this is what I have rocking right now. And this literally, this whole setup took me less than five minutes to get going. And I want to show you guys today exactly how I did it and exactly how you can do it in the same amount of time. So literally to get all this up and running, all you need is to find out a theme that you like, an icon pack that you like, and then something called the Unity Tweak Tool. Which I'll, and I'll show you guys how to install all three of those things. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to find our icon pack and our theme that we like. So you go on Google and just do a simple Google search and I'll have some links below as well for some areas where you can find some custom themes, but I'll have a link to this website, website here as well, which talks about just some top 10 and this guy's opinion, um, one, two themes. So what I'm rocking right now is the, the Numix theme. And if those of you don't know, Numix is actually an open source project. So check them out. I'll have links to them as well. They have, um, an icon pack as well, which is what I'm rocking right now as well. So, the icon pack you see in the theme I'm using are both from the Numix project. So a huge shout to them for all the awesome stuff. And I actually use their icon pack on Android as well. So like I said, check them out. They're pretty awesome. Um, open source and just free stuff. And if you really like their stuff though, I highly suggest, you know, donating them a couple dollars to help keep the project running. Otherwise though, um, so find a, some, find something you like. So you can use the Numix, which I use in this video, um, or you can go scroll down here. You can find some different ones, or you can just go to any random website and find a thing that you like. So what you want to do though to install this or install Icon Pack, uh, you'll want to find like the information and submit it into Terminal. So what you want to do is just open up your um, Unity here and type in Terminal. This will fire up the terminal. And then what you can do is you can paste in each one line of the code. It'll ask for your password, so type that in. And it will go through and enter and it will add uh, each thing in. So what you want to do is you'll want to input each line of code one by one. And while you're done, it will have um, that theme installed on your system. Next thing you want to do is find an icon pack. So installing an icon pack is literally the same thing. So all you're going to have to do is fire up terminal again, copy the code that they give you, or you can type it into if you feel like typing, but copying will probably be easier. So go ahead and enter in the code for that as well. So press enter. And then once you type in the um, source, you'll want to do sudo apt-get 
update. It so updates your sources. So this is the exact same process for installing both themes and icon packs. So as you can tell, you type in just the code that they give you and it will install it. Now, the nice thing about doing it uh, through the app store like this is that it actually allows for updates. So when new icons come out from this icon pack, uh, the creator, what will happen is they'll post it and then you'll get the update and it'll simply update and then you'll have new icons. And the last thing you wanna do is type in this last final code, which will install on your system. Of course, I'm not gonna do this because I already have it installed. So there's no need for me to do this. So now once you've typed in your code, so by pasting it in and you have both a custom theme and icon pack installed or either or you don't have to do both. So once you have one or the two um, installed, all you have to do now is install the Uni tweak tool to apply these settings. So to install the Uni tweak tool, you're going to type in sudo apt dash get install uni tweak tool. I'll have this in the comment section below or the description of this video. That way you can just paste it in the terminal for yourself. So what you want to do is type that in and press enter. And what's going to happen is it's going to get all the information and go ahead and install it for you. And once it's done right here, it is done installing. So you can actually now, we're not done with terminal. So you can actually exit the terminal now. And all you have to do now is type in unity and your tweak tool should show up. So this is the Unity Tweak tool. A lot of cool options here where you can customize a lot of different things like the transparency, so you can get this, this effect right here. But we're gonna go is, we're gonna dive into the theme section. And so by default, you're gonna have this theme right here. You should have your new theme installed uh, in this list. So for me, it's the Numix theme. So all you're gonna do is click on it. And once you click on it, take a half a second and it should apply. Same thing goes with icons. Find your icon pack that, that so by default, you have this one which you find the one that is your icon pack that you installed and click on it. And there you go, your custom icon pack is installed. Otherwise than that, that is pretty much it. So like I showed you guys in what, five minutes, we were able to install a custom theme and icon pack on your system and then have it up and running. For those who, who are wondering, uh, this, icon, this wallpaper is actually included with Ubuntu 14.10. So if you go to wallpapers, it's in the wallpaper section uh, near the bottom right here. Anyways, guys, thanks for watching. Hope you guys did enjoy this, this Ubuntu tutorial. If you did, leave a comment below saying that you did, or leave a comment below saying that you didn't. Or if you're not too much of a typer, feel free to shoot a thumbs up and thumbs down. And of course, tweet me and follow me on Facebook for some more updates um, about the channel and uh, anything else coming. So anyways, guys, thanks for watching. Hope you guys did enjoy and I'll see you in my next video. This is the Hacker 0 7 and I'm signing off.